it's Natasha. And Khalil. And we are the co-hosts of... Woke Woke and Free! Free. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in to our 131st episode of Woke and Free. If you've been tuning in every week for Woke and Free Wednesday, you know that Woke and Free is all about being real and honest with each other and you. We talk about everything and anything important to us, you, the world, and nothing is off the table. Oh gosh, guys. (laughs) This week we are doing... Something super, super special. I'm deeply nervous about it, as I always am with one of our Woken Free uh, oh, story boy. times. This one is called The Distance. So, uh, this is, uh, this is gonna be real, guys. Uh, <laughs> it better be. I'm open it. I'm, I'm super nervous. Okay. But no. before <laughs> we <laughs> dive deep, uh, it's your favorite time of the day. It's Tasha monologue time. So, uh, without further ado, let's get it poppin'. If you have downloaded this episode because you have list, you're listening to it on the Podbean app. Woo! You are a rock star. We love and appreciate you and your support for the show. And we welcome you to join the conversation by adding your comments. That's how you can do it by downloading the Podbean app. So make sure you are doing that so you can join the conversation every single week for Welcome Free Wednesday. If you are like Tasha, I got too many apps. I can't. I love you, smooches. Okay, that's okay. We still love you. Just make sure you're subscribed and following the show on any of the platforms you're on. So whether it's iTunes, TuneIn, it, on Stitcher, SoundCloud, iHeartRadio, Spotify, any of the platforms that you find on the WokenFree.com listen page, then that is okay with us, guys. Now, when it comes to sharing the episode, do you keep it to yourself? Absolutely not. Sharing is caring. Get this out to your friends, your family, your coworkers. Literal strangers, guys. Just start saying Woken Free. Woken Free. WokenFree.com. Have you gone to WokenFree.com? You get the drift? There you go. So chant it? Yes. Right. Woken Free. Woken Free. Woken Free. Woken Free. You can. Yes. i will help you out. Yes. Absolutely. And then, of course, if you want to holler at us on social media, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and Pinterest at Woken Free. And then 90 seconds, guys. Do... Daniel's 90 seconds. Yes, you have to, you have 90 seconds. What okay. can you do? You can review the show on any of the platforms that you listen to us. So we love more iTunes reviews, guys. Five stars, five stars. That's awesome. Uh, and then, of course, what are other platforms you catch us? Stitcher, Google Play, uh, Spotify, iHeartRadio, any of those platforms. Give us a review. 90 seconds. That's all it takes. And you will continue to be loved and appreciated and even possibly shouted out on the platform. So make sure you do that. So, Dan, are we going to get started with the distance thing? The distance. The distance. Are you ready? I'm so nervous. I don't know. Are you nervous? I'm so nervous. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, that's the mystery to me. We'll see. We'll see. I love you. Don't say that. Why shouldn't I say it? I love you. Stop it. No. In fact. (laughs) I'm going to the roof to scream it so everyone knows that I am Kyle Baxter, who is completely and hopelessly in love with you, Star Reeves. You're ridiculous, Kyle. You know you want to say it, too. Kyle, we need to get to class. Nah, I don't think we do. You need to sit closer because we have things to discuss. Like, why you won't say I love you, Kyle? He's so ridiculous. Or at least that is what people on this planet seem to say when people are behaving irrationally or acting downright silly. It is not silly that this sweet and beautiful boy loves me. Really, it is ridiculous for me to be in love with him. Not only am I not from here, I'm not from this planet. Not to mention that I'm over 200 years older than him in human years, but I do love him. I have loved him from the very first day I saw him. It was my first day at high school as a human girl who is a quote unquote junior, which has no actual meaning to me on my home planet. There he was at his locker with James Poole, who is quite the talker that has never has anything important to say. He looked up from his backpack and he stared directly at me. It wasn't that he was looking at me that really shook me, but it was how he was looking at me. It was as if he really saw me, almost as if he knew the secret I was hiding from everyone else and no one else could see it. The look, 
startled me to such a degree that I actually dropped my books in front of my locker. This is how we first met. He said, Hey there. I nodded my head. He smiled. I stared completely overridden with fear that somehow he knew the impossible. I wanted to say something, but I couldn't. And instead I blinked. He smiled again before he said, See you around. Then James and him headed down the hallway. That day was pretty overwhelming. As I tried to wrap my mind around all the stupid things humans live to do or say must be done, schools seemed trivial. The phones these kids were obsessed with were completely annoying. The adults seemed like enlarged children who were miserable and pathetic. Hey there. Do you have a book that you want to share with the Woken Free Nation? Are you a business owner looking to share your product or service with the podcasting world? Well, guess what? You can book an ad with us on our Contact Us page at WokenFree.com. We're super excited to speak with you about curating a unique ad that will get your message across the Woken Free platform. So go to the Contact Us page at WokenFree.com. That is W-O-K-E-N. F-R-E-E dot com, because Woken Free is more than a podcast. It's a way of life and offers an innovative way to promote your platform in the exploding podcasting space. From that day, (laughs) I knew conquering this planet was going to be beyond easy. Human beings are too childlike in how they deal with politics, medicine, education, healthcare, and the environment. On Zertox, we are focused (laughs) on intergalactic exploration, spiritual innovation, and mental elevation. While humans fight over things like skin color, how much money people have, or intentionally harming each other through war or petty crime, human beings are simply barbaric. It, It has been a comical experience reporting on this silly society in my daily reports back home. Soon I will be moving from the reporting stage to actually taking action here. And then what will I do with my love? Loving Kyle makes me feel like an ass, as these humans (laughs) like to say. (laughs) Since I met him, I've been excluding him out of my reports. If Rajat K, the leader of the Earth Mission, would discover this, I would be in more trouble than I would like to think. Back home, lying is not something we do. It, it's, it's too illogical and completely pointless. However, I see this as something that too many human beings love to engage in, no matter how bad they are at it. In my case, I'm not lying per se. Rather, I believe the word omission is more appro- appropriate. If I were to rationalize why I did it, it comes down to my dying need for personal space. My entire life has been very public back home as the daughter of Azro, the leader of my people on planet Zertox. I have been groomed to take his place when he is no longer with us, which will be a very, very long time from now. And in the meanwhile, I've been in front and center for my people from the day I was born. Everything I thought did and said has been public without my consent. And to be honest, I have grown sick of it. Being on earth where humans have so much freedom, it has been very easy to see that I really needed the space and freedom in my life. And by keeping Kyla's secret, I have finally achieved having something for me and me alone, the ramifications of my omission will be great. This I am certain of for now. I want to focus on being with him and being completely in love with him. Roger that. Oh my gosh. (laughs) (laughs) And then Kyle's sitting there wondering why you're talking to yourself. Yes. (laughs) Yes. What was that about Rajok? <laughs> he said. Planet Zertox. Yeah, those are some interesting uh, things that came up. My mouth was open the entire time. Did you see why I was completely petrified? <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing I'll say. My mouth was open the complete time. You totally were left wanting more. <laughs> were you not? It was definitely intriguing. I'll say that. Oh, it's yes, yes. Especially seeing our parlance into the acting world you know (laughs) the voice acting world maybe are yes i think we would be excellent candidates for voice acting if you're interested guys (laughs) you know what you need to do but before we dive deep there let's bring this home it is the coming to the end of our 131st episode of woke and free okay pigeon (laughs) phrase 
<laughs> just showing the different highlights of the voice acting. It can go any way that someone needs. If we need something high, we got that. Deeply misunderstood. Oh, wow. Yes. I don't know who did that. I, don't know. <laughs> I think the Joker. All right. The Joker did that? Yes. Cool, cool beans. <gasps> Listen, guys. This was quite the episode of another special Woken Free story time called The Distance. And we want to know what you thought about that. I am deeply petrified. (laughs) (laughs) But also deeply intrigued to find out what you thought it was about. uh, If you would want to know more. If you'd want to to hear more. Yeah. There's actually more to be heard. But... uh, That's good to know. Yes, there there could be. We need to hear it, guys. We need to know from you. Let us know. And uh, will we leave you hanging for what our next episode will be about? Drum roll, please. On our next episode, we will be discussing, does karma really exist? Make sure you follow us on social media to follow along in the conversation. And make sure you tune in next week for Woken Free Wednesday to join the conversation at WokenFree.com. If you want to be a guest on the show, submit a topic for an upcoming episode or share how you feel, make us make sure you hit us up on our contact us page at WokenFree.com. That is W-O-K-E-N-F-R-E-E.com. If you want to hit us up on social media, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and Pinterest at Woken Free. And then if you are in love with our voices, if you want a curated ad designed for you, your business, your brand, with the Woken Free twist on it, you know what you need to do. Hit us up on our contact us page at WokenFree.com. If you didn't already subscribe, please do. Share the episode. And make sure you come back to join the conversation every Wednesday for Woken Free Wednesdays. Remember, Woken Free is more than a podcast. It is a way of life. Until next time. See you from Planet Zertok.